Welcome back, everybody. This is Joseph R. Wheeler III, artist, founder, and president of the Honest Con Foundation for the second half of our Cyberpunk 2077 fan casting. Let's get it right into it with Dexter Deshaun, who is obviously at first glance in the game a play off of <laughs> Rick Ross. Rose was obvious, and Rose is not a bad actor, but if we want to take it to another level, I think we need a certified thespian like Bashir Salahuddin. Yes, Bashir from Sherman Showcase, who plays Sherman. I think he'd be absolutely perfect for this role after hair and makeup. If you see him also in Southside, yeah, these are two comedies, but I promise you, he can do the serious thing. Have you seen him in Top Gun? Yeah, Bashir Salahuddin for Dexter Deshaun. Now, okay, y'all, let's flip the script. Evelyn Parker. Now, she could be anybody that's got that look, but how about flipping the script? How about Rihanna? She looks amazing in a bob. She's got the attitude and she'd be sexy and mysterious all in one, which is what you need from Evelyn Parker. Riri, bad girl Riri all day. She'd kill it. You hear me? Judy Alvarez, Aiza Gonzalez, easy, easy. Have you seen her in <laughs> The Baby Driver? Yeah, yeah, I think she's got this. Aiza Gonzalez. River Ward. Yeah, let's give it to the homie Damien Poitier. What's up, Damien? I think he's got the stature. He's definitely got the acting chops. And you've seen him before. Oh, yeah, the original Thanos. That's the homie. For real, though. And you've seen him on The Flash and a whole bunch of other stuff. He's got the look. He's got the chops. Damien Poitier. Padre. Sebastian Ibarra. None other than the OG legend himself. Edward James Olmos. It's a natural fit. The moment you've all been waiting for, V. Who could play V? Now, as you know in the video game, V can either be played by a guy or a lady. It's up to you. But that leaves it open in my world to an actor or actress that deserves a first opportunity to be a major name. I say give it to somebody who's not a huge name yet. Somebody who's coming up in the ranks. Somebody who deserves that opportunity to shine and show the world what they've got to offer as an actor. And it does not have to be a white or a white Latino actor or actress. Now, I'm sure they would probably lean that way. It's typical of Hollywood. But you could really flip it. Why not Asian? Why not somebody African-American? Why not somebody who's so mixed they could give you a long grocery list of all of their ethnicities? It is all good. And to me, that's V. V can be anybody. So let the V's show up for auditions and show out. Because this is going to be an amazing movie. Hell, I'd go out for V. That's right. I'd audition for V. I'd be a real badass. Speaking of badasses, have you seen Honest Khan's Cyberpunk 2077 Unfinished Business? Yes, this is a fan-based film written, produced, and acted by yours truly as a character called Mantis. Mantis from Atlantis, meaning ATL, Atlanta, Georgia. Yes, he's a true, serious, about business guy who is the link to the whole story of why V had issues in Atlanta and returns back to Night City. If you haven't seen this, go check it out. It's playing here right now. And I guarantee you, if you play the game, you're going to enjoy my take on why V had to go back home and why he ran from Atlanta. Peep out Cyberpunk 2077 Unfinished Business, starring yours truly, Joseph R. Wheeler III, as Mantis.